day two. Good morning from RSI. This is the first actual day of classes. We got Squilliam. What's up? We got Albert. We're waiting in line at Dunkin' Donuts for breakfast. Albert, want to tell the world how you feel? I feel a little bit tired, but excited for a first day at RSI. So yeah, I get hyped. Yeah, yeah, you know, same as Albert. A little bit worn out for last night, but about to get some great nourishment here at uh, Dunkin' Donuts. So really excited for that, you know. So yeah, good times. It's gonna be a great day. I'm so excited. World, you uh, you heard it here first. <laughs> RSI, getting breakfast, feeling excited. All right, so we just completed our our orientation meeting. Hey, what's up, you know, it's your boy. We're in lecture, about to learn some humanities, talking about Frankenstein and his monster. Um, it's a great time. Look at him go. All right, what's up, guys? It's your boy in the W20 food court. Please don't interrupt me. Just eating some food, having some great conversation. I actually got on my bio lecture recently. We learned about sleep. It was really informative. And I could like feel my mind expanding during the lecture, honestly. Having a great time. Time of my life, to be honest. It's an amazing vlog. I don't know what you're talking about. What's up guys? Hello. Sitting here in an MIT auditorium, uh, ready to learn about some engineering. So I'm really excited, honestly. And please don't interrupt me. I'm just trying to learn on how to like engineer things, uh, become a better engineer. I'll let you know more later. RSI is known for bringing together this year 81 of the world's most interesting people. Here are two of them right now. Here's my co-star. It's your boy uh, Herschel. Herschel. Um, oh, my yeah. friends call me H-Dog, but Ooh, you, you can call me Herschel. H-Dog. Yeah, this is also... Hi, yeah, I'm Yachtin. Yeah. Yachtin Chop. Yeah. Right now, you're looking at the future of the RSI 2018 Ultimate Frisbee team. Over here. Dude, if you make me on, I want to be on that. Okay. Here we are. Yes. Oh, yeah. Like, Yo, so the professor uh, just got here and he rolled some contraption into this room. Squilly, want to tell the world what this is? Yeah, so this is actually um, Tesla's Model Q. Um, not not, not yet released. Um, and we're getting a first look. Also, I just want to like give a shout out to my boy H-Dog for passing out gum to literally everyone around him. A huge power move, to be honest. A so, word from um, our sponsors, Orbit, keeping <laughs> students awake at lecture since uh, 2003. <laughs> You heard dude, it here dude, first. Dude, are you gonna you, you have this, you have Albert, what's up? Not much to do. We're about to go eat dinner at the W20 Student Center. Yesterday we ate some like rad Indian food. Today I don't know where we're gonna eat, but yeah. At that Japanese place sounds cool. You got that like boba stuff, you know? Alright, so what's your name? Yusuf. Okay, so we're sitting in here outside of one of MIT's most iconic establishments, the Dunkin' Donuts. I'm here with Yusuf. Well, we're supposed to find the counselor mm -hmm. who's over there. How, how do you we feel right now? Excited. Um, uh, what are you looking forward most to? Learning more about how the brain works because I've read a bit about neuroscience but I don't really know too much. Alright, alright. All right, at the MIT lecture hall here. We're about to get a lecture by some amazing uh, scientists working at Harvard, Dr. Wolf, and he's going to talk to us about um, some neuroscience leading edge research, and I'm really interested and excited to learn about him, so yeah. Honestly, I have so much feedback. Like, that was a 10 out of 10 lecture. I was so hyped throughout the entire thing. He's doing all these optical illusions, and I was like, whoa, like, I'm seeing this, but really I should be seeing that. I was like, Phew. It was so far, dude. And I'm, I'm right here with my boy Walker from Pennsylvania. Hi. What's up, Walker? Like, P equals NP stuff and yeah. all this cool stuff, dude. This guy's a legend. Or we're about to go and get some, uh, some food at the stud. So really excited for that. It's gonna be a great time. 
RSI is a time in the summer when you're faced with some of the most challenging intellectual questions of our time. Yeah, I mean, really, it's it's a deep philosophical question on the same level as the trolley problem. I mean, Starburst or trolley, Hershey's or Tootsie Roll. These are the difficult decisions that young Americans are faced on a daily basis. And for us to make these decisions takes maturity, confidence, and high levels of intellect. I believe that the uh, candy selection here at MIT is as exquisite as the uh, coursework offered. So here on the top left we have organic sour heads. Not normal sour heads, but organic sour heads. You want to make sure that your gelatin is made without GMOs. Right. Yeah, we here at MIT have a strong belief in sustainability and how we believe that our food should be produced in a very uh, manageable uh, manner. Saving the world one gummy bear at a time, honestly. Just proud that I can support the efforts. Here at RSI, we believe in the next generation of researchers. The next generation is, is right next to me here. He'd like to tell you about some of the critical moments in developing his long and illustrious career. Critical moments, honestly. So like starting off, you know, birth was pretty important. Um, you know, just my first experience in the real world, all the sights and sounds. Yeah, yeah, for sure, dude. Without Would it be fair to say that you couldn't live without your birth? I think so. I mean, like, I thought about it a little bit. I, I would say that's an accurate statement, dude. <laughs> First time that I watched Elmo, I mean, like, that was a defining moment. Because after that, I knew that I wanted to be part of the next generation of researchers. Because I saw if this small, not very attractive stuffed animal could see himself living out his dreams, then so could I. All right, just rolled into the dorms. Uh, Squilly has some words of wisdom for yeah. us. Honestly, man, buying candy and seizing the means of production, that's what RSI is all about. Well, you heard it here first, folks. Buying candy and seizing the means of production. This is what's on the minds of America's next great scientists. <laughs> it's a vloggable moment. <laughs> Will, would you like some tea? <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Horny goat weed. <laughs> Wonderful. I, I appreciate this. Alright world, well, you saw it and heard it here first at RS. <laughs> Alright, so folks, we got the conclusion of the first official day of classes. A day of fun. We learned all sorts of new things uh, with our final words for the day. You heard it here first at RSI.